Hey, what's going on? It's your boy BT, and I came here to talk some NBA with the thousands of True School Sports and subscribers. What's going on, guys? Now, Draymond Green, or before I even say the whole talk about the story, let me say happy belated Halloween, or as we, better yet, as we know it, happy 3 1 day. The Warriors blew a 3 1 lead in the final. Ha ha ha. Anyway, uh, Draymond Green seems to be very, uh, still very frustrated, as many of those players in the locker room are about blowing a 3-1 lead in the NBA Finals and they want a chance at redemption and he, he voices opinions on the potential of maybe playing the Cleveland Cavaliers again and what he would like to do should he play them. He said, I quote, I want to win the Western Conference, try to beat everybody in the Western Conference, which is a tough task. There are so many good teams, so that, that's got to be our only focus, to win the Western Conference. And then if Cleveland comes out of the East, I want to destroy Cleveland. No ifs, ands, and buts about it. But I also know that there's steps to get to that point. And, and if and when we get to that point, I want to annihilate them. And they get there, I want to completely destroy them. No if, ands, and buts about it. They won't change. I'm not saying we're going to look forward to that. Like I said, there's a long road ahead, and it's a tough, tough road to get there. Nonetheless, if we get there, and they get there, I want to destroy them. Really ain't no other way to put it. So there you have it, Draymond Green, who is definitely, even with the addition of Kevin Durant, still the emotional leader of the Golden State Warriors and I think what he's saying echoes pretty much the whole team that they want a chance to, to beat the Cleveland Cavaliers and it's going to take a long way to get to that because this is not the same team that they had last year they lost a lot of key guys uh, Harrison Barnes, Andrew Bogut, Reese Spates, Andrew Barbosa um, guys that are just hard to replace um, and they replaced it with Zaza Pachulia and you know rim protection wise defensively uh, they're not the same team. I don't think they can get, I mean, it's going to be very hard for them to get to the same level defensively that they were last year just, could, just because Andrew Bogut is that much of a difference maker. Now, with all that being taken into account, uh, Andrew Bogut, uh, healthy, they probably would have won the finals last year. And if Draymond Green doesn't suspend it, they won the finals, but that didn't happen. So. You know, they have a lot of moving pieces, the additions of David West, uh, Pachulia, obviously Kevin Durant. Uh, and not just that, the guys they currently have on the team, such as Clay, Steph, Draymond, they got to really figure out their roles because someone has to take a step back and it's going to be in different capacities. I feel like, you know, offensively, you, you, you tend to believe that Draymond Green has to take, uh, Draymond Green and Clay, they're going to have to take a little bit of a uh, less of a scoring load, you know. Draymond, of course, but Clay, that, that's going to be hard for Clay to adjust to due to the fact that Clay was the undisputed second, you know, option on this team, and now he's probably the third option. It means less shots. Uh, so we'll see what happens, man. But uh, it's good to see that the, 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 you know, Draymond Green is voicing uh, his passion to beat to beat the Cavaliers. Um, you know, honestly, on paper they should, they really should be the Cavs. They're, they're a better team. Uh, well. Top, top level at least for the best players, they're all-stars, and more all-stars, so you think they should beat them, but the Cavs have great chemistry, and LeBron James on the other side, you can never count them out, so we'll see, We'll see, man, if, if it does happen, it'll be the first time in NBA history that two teams uh, meet in the finals three straight years in a row, and you know, it is what it is, uh, it'd, be history in the, it'd be history if it happens, but it, it, it's never happened before, so We'll see what happens. But let me know what you think in the comments down below. Draymond Green says he wants to show the Cleveland Cavaliers should the Warriors beat them in the finals. Uh, do you guys want to see them play for the third time? And if so, do you think the Warriors can can beat them this year? Let me know in the comments down below. Take the time to subscribe and you can love me or you can hate me. But I'm just a kid from Dean. So until next time, take care guys.